So I made defenders drop like a bit of time ago, but I found a method to get about like 10k gems per hour ish. Uh, you need like two things before you start. So you need like a, a lot of like alt accounts, which are over 30 days old. Because um, you need you need the account to be over 30 days to redeem the codes, and the codes give like a yeah, ton of gems. And um, you need block strap, which is some like Roblox mod. And I'll go through how to install that. Um, I mean, if you don't have a random alt account sitting around, which you, you probably don't, um, you can like. You can kind of like go into like random Discord servers because like, it's like alt generators for Roblox, but like it's a bit, it's a bit sketchy if you know what I mean. Like, so I, I just like be careful if you're doing that. But like, I, ideally, you have your own alt accounts. Without other way, um, here's how you install Block Shopper. If you if you already have that, or you have another method of having multiple accounts at once, then uh, skip to this time. So after you download Block Strapper, open the game on your main account, then open the game on your first alt, then your second alt, then your third alt. So important step, once all your accounts are in the game, leave the game on one account, like one by one, as shown in the video, and then it will take you to the login screen. So you have to log back in to all your accounts except the one that you most recently joined in and this is because you're having like multiple like accounts in multiple sessions so, you, so you're going to need to log back into them and if you don't then when you when you try going to match with your account it'll give you an error code 773 because you're not logged into that account it's already logged you out so then you get your main to carry all your three alts through the story mode obviously up to mob and you stop at mob and then from there you do the daily quests which would include a challenge so that's that's why you do your story mode other than chips to do the challenge to complete the daily event the daily event will then give you uh, enough xp to get to about level eight so you, you're going to get more gems on your main account if you do modes that you haven't done before because you have 80 more gems if it's your first clear of that version of a level or well, obviously you get 110 gems per per clear as long as it's a new clear so that'll be about 440 per story mode in daily quests there's also that your alt needs to kill 300 enemies which can be hard but if you get your main to have his units at the back of say in the story mode have all your alts uh, like trash unit on then that means they will kill the, the like easy the easy enemies first and then if there's any harder ones then your main could carry through that at the back and then your alt should be able to get 300, 300 enemies killed and then get the daily quest in weekly quests, there's also a thing where if you do 10 story modes, then that means that you'd get 300 gems, so you also add that, add that on at 900. Keep in mind, you can only really do this at like 3 watts at a time, because if you do it like 7, 1, your computer's fried, 2, like, the matches, there's a maximum of 4 people each, so you, you can't just get 7 of them in there, and you can't really multitask between matches. And... So once your accounts reach uh, level 5, so through, through the website on each, on each of the accounts, you're going to want to join the group of the game. And then this will give you access to the like, reward at the start of the game, which gives you 500 gems. It says you need to like the game, but you don't. You just have to join the group. And then at level 8, you redeem all the codes, get all your gems. And then at level 10, you can spend all your gems by giving them to your main. So then, as so for, on average, it took me about 6 minutes per story mode level, and you do 12 story mode levels, so that's 72 minutes worth of story. And then say, maybe 15 minutes for the challenge, which makes all of the daily events done. And then that will result in have enough XP to get to level 10 and then do all the codes. Um, also make sure that you're completing all the other daily events, obviously, because you're not going to be able to get that 500x XP from the daily events to get up to level 10 if you haven't done all the other daily quests on that account. 72 minutes and you add the challenge onto that and that results in then you get some gems from that and then you get gems from the daily quest as well so you factor that in and you also get gems from the codes if they're available and then you also get gems from joining the group so that overall would result in about 5k gems each per account after about an hour and 30 minutes which 
evens out to 10k gems an hour. You will, you will need accounts that are over 30 days. You can either just like have on standby, or you can use generators. Kind of this. But once again, it's actually, actually be careful if you're doing that.